feeding horses. And then it's just, what's next, right? So this is the ranch, folks. Look at this. This is where the equine gestalt coaching method is taught. Touched by a horse, Melissa Pierce. I can't stress enough how life-changing this program has been for me as a student. Life-changing. I'm finally living in my true authentic self with still a whole lot more work to do, but it is life-altering. Melissa is a beautiful soul and I thank God every day that she was brought into my life. Good morning from Elizabeth, Colorado. This is my uh, my bed in the yurt. I'm here for two weeks for core. I'm in the equine gestalt coaching program. I'm a junior, almost a senior. I'll show you the outside. The sun is coming up. It's absolutely stunning. Having my morning coffee. We have a student, we have a student lounge here with showers, three showers, kitchenette, toaster ovens, refrigerators, tables, all that. So it's, they set you up pretty well here. This is Melissa Pierce's book, What the Heck is Gestalt? She's an author of many books. She's the founder of the equine gestalt coaching program and touched by a horse i'm here on her property core class begins this afternoon at 4 p.m it is now maybe 4 30 a.m and of course i'm on connecticut new england time so i'm wide awake having my first cup of coffee i enjoy mornings if you haven't seen this book or heard of it, I encourage you to get it. Whether you're interested in being a gestaltist or not, it is truly an eye-opener.
This is where we are in Elizabeth, Colorado, 6,600 feet in elevation. So I got super, super lucky. How cool is this thing? Check out the, this is how you put it in drive, park. You can tell I drive a 14 year old Equinox back at home because I didn't even know how to put this thing in gear when they gave it to me at budget car rental at the airport. I rented a compact car and they didn't have any so I got upgraded for free to a Honda whatever this thing is Odyssey let me tell you this is a nice van it's huge it is huge I wish I had more people I have two rows of seats and a back area for luggage and cargo it's massive I'm enjoying it maybe I'll after I do my midterm on Monday, I'll go out exploring. I have today off until 4 o'clock when we meet for our check-in, core check-in. And then uh, after that, every day, 9 to like 5 or 6, we are in core camp. I love it here. It's very peaceful. I slept beautifully last night. Here, here's me with no makeup on. I'm a little flushed. But uh, super stoked, been studying and, you know, letting, trusting and surrendering and realizing that, um, you know, whatever's going to be is going to be. We're pretty excited. I just got off the phone about an hour ago with Carl. He accepted, he was offered and accepted a job on a ranch out in Montana. He'll be out there for four months. And... Scott and Nikki and I will be holding down the fort in Connecticut. I know I'm going to cry. I'm so happy for him. I know this is going to turn into even more opportunities. Um, he will be an executive chef there, but also they really want his input on things. They're like a big think tank there. They do really upscale retreats. He gets to be around horses and people and do the craft that he absolutely loves. So. Um, to say that I'm thrilled for him is an understatement. I think this is the beginning of a new journey for all of us. So I'll keep checking in with you guys all during the week. I, unfortunately and fortunately, I'm not going to be filming during um, our work here at CORE. But I will be putting feelers out to see if there are people who will or would be interested in doing interviews for the Backstreet Horse... The Backstreet... Backstreet? Ha! Ah, that was the record label I was once signed to back in the day when I was a musician. Um, the Backyard Horse Enthusiast. Uh, looking forward to uh, to meeting my co-core campers. Talk to you soon. Tuesday. It was in the high 80s. Colorado sure could use this. They'll take moisture any way they can get it right now. But uh, it's still snowing. I heard it's in the 90s back in Connecticut. Wow.
Oaks, week two on the ranch. Look at this view, I'm out on the bridle path, walking at 6 a.m., absolutely stunning. My friend and classmate Wendy and her husband are over there at that ranch. She just has to walk to the arena every day. I've made some beautiful friends here. I highly recommend the Equine Gestalt Coaching Method program to anyone who's interested in coactive coaching with their equine partner. This has been an amazing journey. I'm going into my senior year, uh, senior year, senior semester, and uh, looking forward to taking uh, some of their other programs, the facilitation program and the grad coaching method program eventually as well. Um, if you wanna grow spiritually, emotionally, this is where you do it. I can't recommend it enough. I just can't. It's been a blessing. Thank you, Melissa Pierce, and Touched by a Horse, and all of my herd mates. You've made this an amazing journey, and I look forward to my future, finally. God bless. <laughs>